Hello and welcome to this session from Taslet Factory, where we'll show you the mobile WMS solution, the Android edition for Dynamics NAV. In this session, we'll focus on the user interface of the solution, and we'll show you how easy it is to add and remove icons from the mobile WMS menu. All right, let's take a look at the application. Just find the icon and we'll push, press here. Now we'll come to the login screen. This is a scanning solution, so we're actually able to just scan a barcode, a GS128 barcode, like this. And we'll go directly to the mobile WMS menu. The mobile WMS application, it's a data collection tool with offline capabilities that's able to communicate with the ERP system, in this case NAV, without any system in between. And we have created a user interface that resembles a smartphone interface because we want to hide all the complexity of the full Dynamics ERP client for the warehouse worker. So he or she just can focus on the warehouse tasks. All right, but let's say we're in a warehouse where we only need to use the receive, count, the put away and the move function. So to make it more clear for the warehouse worker, we're able to move the rest of the, the functionalities. So let's try and do that. We'll go to departments here in nav. And here you can see under departments, we have the TF mobile module installed. Here you can go to setup, go to mobile groups, click navigate, and here's the mobile menu. So as you can see here on the screen, we have all the same functionalities here in nav as on the mobile device. And as I said, we are going to move almost all of them you just mark them and hit delete and click yes. So let's go to the mobile device and see what happens. Click the back button and click login again. And now you can see we have only four functionalities available. Let's just say we forgot one in the process and uh, we want also to be able to pick items. Of course, that's a very useful warehouse feature. We'll just find the pick function here and what we'll do is we'll place this as number two and sorry two and place the move the count function as number five and there's also a three here we'll click okay and we'll go to the mobile device again hit the back button and log in again and here now you can see that we have the receive, the pick function, the put away, move and count function available on the mobile device. So that was it, the mobile WMS menu and how you can add and remove icons from the mobile WMS menu. Thanks for watching.